رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين ومن تبعهم بإحسان إلى يوم الدين أما بعد رب شرح لي صدري ويسر لي أمري وحل العقد من لساني يفقه قولي رب يسر ولا تعسر وتممه بالخير وبك نستعين يا فتاح يا فتاح يا فتاح سبحانك لا علمنا إلا ما علمتنا إنك أنت العليم الحكيم Alhamdulillah, we finished Surah Tawbah yesterday. We started and finished Surah Tawbah yesterday, Alhamdulillah. Uh, inshallah, we'll begin with Surah Yunus today. Um, so, the, the Surah, Surah Yunus, it's a um, Makki Surah. So, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala talks about more. Um, it follows more about uh, it's just, Allah SWT talks more about Tawheed and about Risala, about the oneness of Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, He in this surah He talks about that the how the intercession, where only no one can intercede, intercede only with the help of Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, He talks about the Deen and. Tells the mushrikeen to accept Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, accept the deen and follow Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. billahi min ash-shaytani rajim Bismillahi rahmani rahim Alif la mara Tilka ayatul kitab al-hakim Akana lin nasi ajaban an awhayna ila rajulim minhum an adhirin nasa wa bashirin ladhina amanu wa bashirin ladhina amanu anna lahum qadama sadaqin inda rabbihim qana al-kafirun inna hadha lasahirun mubin inna rabbakum allahu aladhi khanaq al-samawati wal-arda fi sitati ayyamin thumma stawa ala al-arsh يدبر الأمر ما من شفيع إلا من بعد إذن ذلكم الله ربكم فاعبدوه أفلا تذكرون So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala he starts off with the حروف مقطعة ألف لام راء أمي الله سبحانه وتعالى knows the meanings of the letters تلك آيات الكتاب الحكيم these are the verses of the wise book of the Quran which is filled with wisdom. Are people surprised that we sent revelation to a, uh, a to a person, to a man, meaning Rasulullah for among them that warn the people and warn the people and give good, give good, uh, give good news, give glad tidings to the mu'mineen, to the believers. And that they shall surely be a great position for them, right near the Rabb, Qal Kafirun, and the Kuffar. They say that indeed. Uh, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam in the hadha mubin is a clear magician. In the Rabbakum Allah, who led the Khalaq as Samawati, will order the feast at Ayam. Indeed, your Rabb is Allah's mother who created the heavens and the earth in six days, right? And then he turned his attention to the Mustawa al Ash, he turned his attention to the throne. Ma min shafi'an illa min ba'd idni, there shall be intercession only with his. After his permission, no one will be able to intercede on the day of Qiyam without Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's permission. That is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala who is your Rabb. So, fa'abudu, worship him, and afarat al do you not take heed? Will you not listen to the advice? Will you not listen to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? To him shall all be returned after death. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's promise is true. Without doubt, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created everything. And then he will. Repeat it, meaning he will create it again after after when he destroys and after when he uh, after the death. And the Allah Subhanahu wa Taala, the Allah Subhanahu he would um, those who have those who carry a good deeds and those who have iman, they'll be rewarded with justice. And that's for those who commit kufr and who just believe in Allah SWT, they shall have jahannam. They should have a drink of boiling water and painful. They will have painful punishment because of because they committed kufr. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Allah is the one who created the sun as a as a light. 
والقمر نورا and the moon as a as a glow and he had وقدره منازل and he has appointed stages and phases right of the of the moon uh, لتعلم عدد السنين so that you may know the so you may know the count of the years right by passing the months and the calculation of the time what ما خلق الله ذلك الله سبحانه has created these only for the إلا بالحق except for truth for the purpose and nothing just except for the truth and يفصل يفصل الآيات لقوم يعلمون he explains the ayat for the people who have knowledge إن في إن في اختلاف الليل والنهار وما خلق الله في السماوات والأرض لآيات لقوم يتقون indeed the changing of the night and the day and whatever Allah subhanahu wa taala has created when all the and في السماوات والأرض in the skies and the earth are the ayat are the signs of Allah subhanahu wa taala and about the greatness and the oneness of Allah subhanahu wa taala الآيات لقوم يسو for the people who have تقوى إن الذين لا يرجون لقاء أنا لا أرضو بالحياة الدنيا وطمع أنه بها indeed those إن الذين لا indeed those who do not wish to meet a لقاء أنا ورضو بالحياة الدنيا and they are pleased with the and they are content with the um life of the world what what manubiha walla the humanayat in a half moon and they are those are the ones who are um they are unaware or they are awful from our ayat well i come out one now so these are the ones who who's up uh, who's uh their the abode or their place is the fire be my can you see one because of what they earn because of what they do with their actions in that ladina am and why i mean the story how the idea of rabbi will be in my name Uh, those who have iman and do good deeds, right? Their Rabb shall, or Yahdihim Rabbuhum, they the Rabb should guide them because of their iman. Tajrim and Tahtiwan and Harud, they shall have rivers, they shall have rivers flowing beneath them in Jannah, right? Of Jannah and Jannat and Naim, the Jannah of bliss, the Garden of bliss. Da'wahum fiha subhanak Allahumma wa tahiyyatum fiha salamu akhir da'wahum and alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. So, Meaning in the beginning of the prayer, right? In Jannah, they shall be, Oh Allah, da'wahum fiya, subhanaka Allahumma. Their calling will be, the prayer, the dua will be, Oh Allah, you are, subhanak, you are pure, you are pure. Da'wahum, subhanaka Allahumma. Oh Allah, tahiyyatum fiya, salam. Oh Allah, you are pure. Meaning they will be glorifying Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala all the time and there will be no need for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to ask. There will be no need to ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for anything because they will have everything they desire without having Without asking Allah Subhanahu wa Taala, and their greeting, tahiyyatun fiya, the greeting will be salam. Wa akhir du'a wa min alhamdulillahi rabbil alamin. And the end of the prayers, at the end of the du'a, will be alhamdulillahi rabbil alamin. All praise belongs to Allah Subhanahu wa Taala and the Rabb of the universe. Wa lo yajjul Allah li nasi shar wa sijjal min khayr la qudi rim ajlum. If Allah Subhanahu wa Taala sends quickly or rushes evil to the people, as they want good to rush to them. The, uh, if they want, uh, if if Allah rush, if Allah uh, sends quickly, or if He rushes evil to the people as they want good to rush their way, then laqudi ilayhim, their time would have expired for them. The time would have finished for them. We shall leave those who do not wish to meet us, or to wander blindly and to be confused. Yamahun in their disobedience. Tuliyani yamahun to be wander blindly in their and and to be confused. And their disobedience. وإذا ما سأل إنسان الضر دعانا رجب به أو قاعدا أو قا أو قائما. When any hardships afflicts a man, when when any hardship afflicts a man, a kafir, the دعانا لجب به he prays to us, right? He prays to us. قاعدا أو قائما laying down, sitting or standing. However, ولما كشفنا عنه ضره مرة كألم. When we remove the hardships from him, كألم يدعونا إلى ضر مسا. He continues to commit kufr as if he had never prayed to us, right? And As for the hardship that afflicted him, as if the hardship that never that he's praying, he he continues to come to kufr as if he had never prayed to us for the hardship that afflicted him. In this manner, the action of those who oversteps who overstep the limits and transgress the limits of Allah Subhanahu wa Taala are made appealing to them. وقال قد أهلك من القرون من قبلكم لما ظلم وجاءت مسلا بالبينات وما كانوا ليؤمنوا بما ليؤمنوا كذا كان جزء القوم المجرمين ولقد أهلكنا القرون القرون من قبلكم without doubt we destroyed many generations before you لما ظلم when they oppressed when they committed shirk وجاءت مسلا بالبينات the رسول came to them the prophet came to them with clear signs بالبيان وما كانوا ليؤمنوا but did not they they did not accept Islam did not believe كذا كان جزء القوم المجرمين and then we punished the those who were sinful ثم جعلنا لكم خلائف في الأرض من بعدهم لنظر كيف تعملون. Thereafter, after these people who were destroyed, we made خلائف في الأرض. We made successors on earth after them. 
to see how you behave, to see whether if you would learn a lesson or not from their wrongdoings. وإذا تتلى عليهم آياتنا بينات قار الذين لا يجون قاء نأتي القرآن غير هذا أو بدل when our verses of our uh, are recited to them when the verses of the Quran are recited to them uh, those who do not wish to meet us in, uh, uh, say وبدلهم من تلقاء they say bring us another Quran besides this إن أتبع إلا ما يوحى إليه or they say to وبدلهم من تلقاء نفسي they say um, they say that change it or bring another Qur'an. So tell them, in tell them, it is not permissible for me to alter it. It is not permissible for me to change it for my own self, my own, for my own side. I follow only what Allah SWT revealed to me. If I disobey, if I disobey Allah SWT, then the punishment of the day of Qiyamah uh, in the uh, uh, fear of Allah SWT and the adab ibn Azim, the punishment of the um, the great punishment of the day of the day of Qiyamah. Wallahu sha Allahu ma talo tuariyyu ma ladaratun bi. So say to the kuffar or Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Wallahu sha Allah if Allah SWT willed ma talo tuariyyu ma ladaratun wa ladaratun bi. I would not have recited it, meaning the Quran to you, nor would he have informed you about it. I have already lived a great portion of my life among you right? during the time which um, he was not able to tell anything similar to the Quran. Right? So do you so do you not understand? Because uh, he's saying that I have already lived a great portion of, the of my life among you. I already stayed with you for for a long time. Do you not understand? Who can be more unjust than the person who invents lies against Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala or rejects his ayat? The fact that the sinful ones will never be successful. They worship besides Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and what the the gods they, they do not harm them meaning if you if they do not worship them it won't harm them nor it will not benefit from it will not benefit them if you worship them worship them these are they say that this mushikin they say these are our intercession these are our intercessors with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala are you informing Allah of what he does what of what he does not know in the heavens and the earth that he has partners about whom Allah SWT he has no knowledge about? No, subhana. This is definitely wrong. Subhana, Allah SWT, he is pure. He is pure and high above. Wa ta'ala amma yashikun with that which the partners that you ascribe to him. Wa ma kana wa ma kana nasu illa ummatan wahidatan fakhtalafu. Mankind wa ma kana illa ummah. Mankind was just a single nation. Fakhtalafu after they differed. Wa lawla kalimatun sabaqat. If it were not for a decision that issued uh, that, that was from your Rabb, meaning that they are they are about to be punished right after at a later time, only in the Akhirah. If it was not for the decision decision that came from your Rabb, then the matter would have been decided between them concerning the matter would have been the the matter would have been decided between them concerning that about which they deferred, meaning if the time for the punishment had not been already uh, set in the future day. The kuffar would have already had they, they already have learned that they are wrong when Allah SWT punishment will destroy them and the leaves and Allah SWT will leave the mu'min and harm. The, they say, may the mushikin of Makkah they say, uh, why is an ayah a miracle that we wish, right? Min Rabbi not revealed to him to Rasulullah from his Rabb. Tell them the knowledge of the unseen is only with Allah SWT. So wait. Right? Wait. Indeed, I am waiting. Indeed, I am waiting. When we let the people taste our mercy after difficulty uh, has afflicted them, they suddenly have a plan, a plot against our ayat and they reject our ayat and start mocking them. So Allah says, Allah is swifter in planning. 
in the rusul na indeed our messengers angels are recording whatever you plan whatever you do whatever you make you plot against allah subhanahu wa ta'ala against the ayat of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wal ladhi yusayyirukum fil barri wal bahri it is he who allah subhanahu wa ta'ala allows you to travel peacefully on land and see hatta idha kuntum fil bahri until the time comes when you are in a ship and it sails with them وجرينا بهم بريح طيبة وفرحوا بها جاء تاريخ عاصف by a pleasant wind and they are happy and until a strong wind suddenly strikes them and the waves come to them from every side and they think that they are موجود من كل مكان وظنوا أن محيط بهم that they think they think that they are surrounded and that they will be uh, that they will drown that they will be drowned and they pray دعوا الله مخلصا they start praying to Allah with sincere the soul sincere right and they with sincere with sincere and faith in him and they say they say oh Allah if we if you rescue us from this then we'll certainly be from amongst the grateful one but however when he rescues them and he allows them to reach the the shore safely then they suddenly start uh they start causing corruption engaging in sin on earth without uh without any just Cause, yeah, O oh, people, your corruption, the shirk and the sin, the oppression, right? Is it's uh, it's because you will suffer. You suffer the consequences in this world, especially in the akhirah. So enjoy. So so matar al hayat dunya fil akhirah. So enjoy, enjoy the pleasures of this world for a short while, then. Then you shall return to us and we will inform you that which you used to do. Right? So the dunya is the example of the worldly life is like the water that we send from the sky. Which, which nourishes the plants of the earth, the, which the, the, the men, with the humans and the animals they eat, the people and the animals eat until the earth reflects you know the, the when it flourishes with vegetation it becomes uh, it becomes beautiful and their inhabitants think that they are uh, its masters and they can harvest the crops whenever they please and then our command meaning the punishment in the form of disaster comes to the, the the crops uh, the, the, our command the punishment comes in a form of disaster and comes to it by night or by the day then turning the crop into a pile of reaped harvest right it'll be useless to a person as if it has never been existed before and this is how this does. We explain the ayah, the signs for those who ponder, for those who reject. By inviting towards people towards Islam, Allah calls them السلام, towards a home of peace, the Jannah, where a place for you from sorrow or calamity and right, no trouble. He guides guys when we wills and to the Salatul Mustaqim to the straight path. الَّذِينَ أَحْسَنُ الْحُسْنَى وَزِيَادَةِ وَلَا يَرْهَقُ وُجُوهُ وَجُوهَهُمْ قَتَرُ وَلَا ذِلَّ وَلَا يَسْحَبُ لِلَّهُمْ فِيهَا قَارِدُونَ For those who do righteous deeds, they shall be the best. Uh, they should be the best and more. Uh, they should be more. وَلَا يَرْهَقُ وُجُوهُمْ قَتَرُ وَلَا ذِلَّ Neither darkness nor any disgrace will cross their face. وَلَا يَسْحَبُ لِلَّهُمْ فِيهَا قَارِدُونَ They are the people of Jannah. They will live in And now as for those who earn, who do evil actions, the punishment for, for evil will be like that of it, of on their faces they'll be covered in disgrace and there shall be no protector for them, for them right? From the punishment of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It will be as if their faces have been covered by a part of an extremely dark night. And these are the, the people of fire from Fiyah Khalim, they'll live in it forever. And do not forget the day when we will gather them all together and we shall then tell those, then we should tell those who commit, who commit shirk. You and your partners will remain or will remain where you are. 
right? So that you may, uh, uh, you may take account for your behavior in the world, right? You will then separate them and their partners, or they'll say that you, you never worship us. So Allah must suffice that witness between us and you. In Kunna and Ibadum Lawakirin, the and the fact the matter is that we were unaware of your worship. Uh, at the time where every soul will uh, carefully analyze what it has what it did before in this world, they will return. They will be returned to Allah Subhanahu wa Taala and there, the true master, Allah Subhanahu wa Taala. Whatever they invented will be lost to them. We will not be able to help. We will not be able to assist them at all. Say to the machine who provides for you rain from the sky and the earth, or who is in control? Who is in control of the ears and the eyes? Who extracts the Who extracts the living from the dead and the dead from the living? And who plans all the matters? Say, they will surely, they will soon reply, Allah, tell them. That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is your true Rabb. After the truth, there is only only deviation. So where are you wandering off? The decree of your Rabb is justified, truthful against the disobedient ones. And that they will definitely, they will not have Iman. Say, are there any of the partners who can create something from nothing? Are there any partners who can create something from nothing? And then create it again the second time after it's been destroyed. No, say Qulillah, say Allah is the one that He creates from nothing and then He can create Qulillah Ibn al Khalqa Tumu Yiridu Fanatu Fakun. Allah is the one that creates from nothing and then creates again the second time after it's being destroyed. So, Fanatu Fakun, where are you wandering off? Where, where are you going astray? Qulhal Mi Shuraka Iku May Yahdi Ilad al Haq, Qulillah Yahdi al Haq, Afama Yahdi al Haq, Ya Haq, and you took Amad Lai Hiddi Lai, the Afama Lakum Kapat Hamun. You say to the Mushikin, are any of your partners uh, capable of guiding towards towards the truth? Say Allah SWT guides towards the truth. So Allah SWT is guide, who he's, Allah SWT is the one who guides to truth and, and he is more worthy of following. Or or is your gods, is he who cannot find any guidance uh, unless he's shown the way? So what is the matter with you? What is the matter with you? How do you judge? How can you worship something that does not deserve to be worshipped? Most of them, most of the they follow only assumptions. Indeed, assumptions, one of the, uh, there's, there's no, uh, it does not help against the truth. In Allah, I mean, my friend, without doubt, Allah has perfect knowledge of what you do. This Quran is not such that it could be produced without Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And then beside Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala could make it. However, it confirms, right? It confirms those, meaning the previous books that came before it, and is detailed, is what uh, kitab is detailed explanation of that which has been uh, decreed. There's no doubt, there's no doubt in it. It comes from uh, the Rabb of the universe. Do they mean the Mushikin say that Rasulullah fabricated it in the Quran? Tell them then, tell them, then produce even a single surah like, like it. And call whoever you can that can help you besides Minduna besides Allah Sumatra and if you are truthful and However, they deny they deny the Quran, the knowledge of which they can they could not encompass. 
and the the outcome of which has not yet come to them. In this manner, those those people, uh, those people before them, they rejected the Anbiya. And so, uh, so see what will happen to the the outcome of the oppressors. Right? Those who rejected the Anbiya and the and the prophets, the the books, the outcome is clear. Among them, the people of Makkah is he who believes in the Quran and he does not, and who does not believe in it. Your Rabb is the best, your Rabb is best, and he is aware of those who spread corruption. If they reject you, then say to them, My actions are mine, and your actions are yours. You are, you are free from what I do, and I am free from what you do. Among them, the people of Mecca, are those who listen uh, to you, to Rasulullah Can you make the deaf, those who do not want to listen, with the intention of accepting? Can you make the deaf hear when they cannot even, when they cannot even understand? Uh, among them is, the, is he who looks at you, and can you show the way to the blind when they cannot, when they cannot even see? Inna Allah la yadhimun nas ashiya wa nakin na nas anfusahum yadhimun. Allah SWT says, indeed, Allah SWT does not oppress people in the, at all, but people, wa nakin na nas anfusahum yadhimun, but people oppress themselves. Wa yawman yahshurum ka allam yalbatu illa sa'ata min al-nahari yata'arafuna baynahum. On the day, the day of Qiyamah, when we will gather them, all of the people, it will seem as if they had stayed, min al-nahari yata'arafuna baynahum, they stayed only for a moment, a moment of a day. They will recognize each other. They will recognize each other. Surely, truly, those people who are at loss and who reject the meeting with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, they will be, they will not be rightly guided. If we were to show you, in Rasulullah, a part of the punishment we have promised them, or if we were to claim your soul, meaning if we were before punishing them or without punishing them, then uh, then their their return shall be to us. And then Allah's mother is witness over what they do. For every nation, for every nation, there is a Rasul. Right? And so when Rasul so when a Rasul came to them, their matters was decided. They were decided with justice. And they were not oppressed. When will this promise me the punishment? Come if you are in good Musadiqeen, if you are chosen. Say to them, Rasulullah, I do not possess the power to harm or to benefit. Illa mashallah, except with Allah SWT if he wants. There is an appoint there is a appointed term, a time fixed for every nation. When their term arrives, they cannot delay it for even a little bit, nor they cannot nor they cannot bring it forward. Say to them, if uh, tell them, uh, if he punish, if if his punishment comes to you, at night or during the day, then what is what is it that the sinful ones wanted to hurry? I mean, what was the need to keep asking for the punishment when it's meant to come instead of asking for it? Right, the kuffar they start seek for they start seeking for Allah's protection from it. Will it be that you believe in it, meaning the punishment of Allah SWT, only when it occurs? Now, when before this you wanted to hurry it. If the people accept this, if the, if the people accept Iman only when Allah SWT arrives, then the Iman will not be accepted. Or it will be said to them, do you accept Iman now only, now, Al-An? Now, before this, you wanted to hurry it. You kept asking when the punishment would come to, to frustrate Rasulullah SAW. 
ثم قيل الذين ظلموا ذوقوا العذاب then when the, when the dead are they're, they are raised on the day of Qiyamah they tell them الذين ظلموا to those who, who oppress and those who die as guffar ذوقوا العذاب peace everlasting punishment عذاب الخلد the everlasting punishment هل تجون إلا ما كنتم تكسبون and you will be punished only for what you used to earn what you used to do وإذا سبئونك حق هو قل إيه ورب إنه لحق وما أنتم بمعجزين they the kuffar they ask you من رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم is it really the truth قل هو قل إيه ورب إنه لا yes I swear by my Rabb it is the truth وما أنتم بمعجزين وما في بوت إسكيب وني كوني كمز ولو أن لكل نفس ظلمت ما في الأضي لفت به وأسر الندامة لما رأوا العذاب if every oppressed soul the kuffar possessed whatever wealth is in the earth they would have offer and ransom to save themselves from the punishment of Allah سبحانه وتعالى the kuffar leaders they will hide their remorse وأسر الندامة لما رأوا العذاب when they see the punishment so that the followers do not mock them on the day of Qiyamah. وَقُضِيَ بَيْنَهُمْ بِالْقِسْ And judgment will be passed between them. All the patients with بِالْقِسْ with justice. وَلَوْهُمْ لَا يَذْلَمُونَ They will not be oppressed. أَلَا إِنَّ لِلَّهِ مَا فِي سَمَاوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضِ Behold to Allah belongs whatever is in the heavens and the earth. وَلَا إِنَّ وَعَدُ اللَّهِ Behold indeed the promise of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is true. وَلَكِنَّ أَكْثَرُمْ لَا يَعْنَمُونَ Most of them do not know. وَيُحْيَ وَيُمِيتُ وَإِلَيْهِ تُرْجِعُونَ Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He is the one who gives life and causes death and you will return to Him. Indeed, the advice of the Qur'an has come to you from your Rabb and is a cure for what is in the evil qualities of your heart. Indeed, the advice of the Qur'an has come to you what is the evil qualities and the doubt and the wrong beliefs and the, the diseases of the heart, right? Isn't, it's a cure for that, what's in the hearts. وَهُوَ As a guidance and the mercy for the believers. قل بفضل الله وبرحمته فبذلك فليفرحوا هو خير مما يجمعون. Say about the grace of Allah subhanahu wa taala's mercy in the Quran. About this you you should rejoice. Right? These are the things that you should be uh, worth rejoicing and uh, with gratitude. فذلك it is better, right? هو خير لكم is better than what wealth and property and all those things. خير مما يجمعون the the kufar they accumulate and they gather. قل أرأيتم ما أنزل الله لكم بالرزق فجعلتم منه حراما وحلالا قل الله أذن لكم أم على الله تفترون سيد هم تلبى تسسنة الفود that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has provided you provided you for uh, provided for you some of which you uh, you make haram of your own from your own side and others they make halal قل الله أذن لكم سيء has Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala permitted you may, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make halal for you to make these things halal or make it haram or are you making inventing lies against Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? So uh, what do those who invent lies about Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mean? The mushrikeen who say that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has partners. What do those who invent lies about Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala think about the day of Qiyamah? Inna Allah ladhu fadhi indi Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the most gracious to ladhu fadhi an nas to the people wa lakinna athar ma yashun but most of the people are ungrateful. Wa ma takunu fi sha'ni wa ma takunu minu min qur'ani wa la ta'amalu na min amali illa kunna alaykum shuhudan ittu fi dhuna fi. We are witnesses to whatever conditions you, meaning Rasulullah s.a.w. are in. And to whatever portion of the Qur'an you are reciting and to every action that you, meaning the people may be doing even while you are engaged in it. وَمَا يَعْزُبَ عَنْ رَبِّكَ مِثْقَالِ ذَرَّةٍ فِي الْأَرْضِ وَلَا فِي السَّمَاءِ وَلَا أَصْغَرَ مِنْ ذَلِكَ وَلَا أَكْبَرَ إِلَّا فِي كِتَنْ مُبِينَ Not even Adam's way in the earth and in the sky escapes the knowledge of your Rabb. And there is nothing smaller or larger than this. And this is, than than this, that is not, which is not recorded in the clear book. Everything, there's nothing small or big that is not recorded in the clear book. Everything is recorded. أَلَا إِنَّ أُولِيَا اللَّهِ لَا خَوْفٌ عَلِيهِمْ وَلَا هُمْ يَحْزَنُونَ Behold, verily, for the, the friends of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, there shall be no fear. لَا خَوْفٌ عَلِيهِمْ Nor there shall be any grief. No fear and grief. الَّذِينَ آمُنُوا كَانُوا يَتَّقُونَ Those are the people of Iman who are dead taqwa. لَهُمْ الْبُشْرَةِ فِي الْحَيَاةِ وَفِي الْآخِرَةِ For them, there shall be glad tidings in this life and the hereafter. لَا تَبْدِرِ كِلَمَاتِ اللَّهِ There is nothing that can change the word, the decree, and the promise of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And this is the, the ultimate great success. وَلَا يَحْزُونَكَ قَوْلُهُمْ O Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, do not let their speech grieve you. In al-izzati Allah, Allah Sallallahu Alaihi belongs to Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Who is the Sami'ul Alim? Allah is all hearing and He's all knowing. Allah in Allah, Ma Sumawati Ma Filad. Behold, already only Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam belongs to whatever is in the skies and whatever is in the earth. O Ma Yatibur Allah, the Yadurani Min Yadurani Allah, He Shulaka. Who do those people follow who call upon their partners besides Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam? 
they follow in Allah when we like Rasulullah, they follow only assumptions and they lie. Allah has made the night so that you may so that you can uh, may rest and you can get peace in it. And he has made the day as a means of seeing. Indeed, this is, uh, this is a sign, ayat for those who listen. They say that Allah has taken a son. Subhana, Allah is pure. No, ever. والغني, he is independent. For him, Allah so belongs to whatever is in the skies and whatever is in the earth. Whatever is, you have no proof. You have, you have no proof for this. Do you say about what Allah what you do not know? Say surely those who invent lies about Allah will not succeed. Those who invent lies about Allah will not succeed. You can enjoy only for so enjoy in this world for a short time. Then you will return to you will return to be towards us. Then you will, we will taste you the the painful punishment because of you because of used to come to kufr. وَاتْلُوا عَلَيْهِمْ نَبَأَ نُوحِ قَالَ لِقَوْمِهِ يَا قَوْمِ إِنْ كَانَ كَبُرْ عَلَيْكُمْ مَقَامِ وَتَذْكِرِي بِآيَةِ اللَّهِ فَعَلَى اللَّهِ تَوَكَّلْتُ فَأَجْمِعْ أَمْرَكُمْ وَشُرَكَاكُمْ ثُمَّ لَا يَكُنْ أَمْرُكُمْ عَلَيْكُمْ قُمَّةً ثُمَّ قَضُوا إِلَيَّ وَلَا تُنْظِرُونَ Our Rasulullah said to them the incident of Nuh salam where he told them the time when he said to his people قَالَ لِقُمِ يَا قَوْمِ وَمَا people if if I if my stay among you and my reminders of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala are difficult upon you then only in all the other then I trust in only Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So you and your partners uh, decide your affairs and then do not let your affairs be a secret. Meaning pass your, pass your decision on me. Then do not let your affairs be a secret. Meaning pass your decision on me. Do what you have decided. And uh, do not grant me any respite because I'm not, I'm not afraid of all of you. If you turn away, you refuse to accept my message, then remember that I have never asked any reward from you. In Allah, my reward shall only be soon from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. In Umirtu Anakuna Mil Muslim, I have been commanded to be from those who submit and who are Muslim. Fakadabu Fanajina, who are Mamma, who feel full Kiwaj Allah, Khalaif, or Melanin Katabu, I don't know, for Kifa Kana, Kutan Mundarin. They made the, the people in Wa'alaikum Salaam, they rejected him, so we rescued him and those who were with him, the believers, right, in the ark when the flood came. And we made them khalaif, we made them successors. And we drowned, we drowned those who rejected our ayat. So see what was the, the outcome of those who were warned and they didn't listen. We sent after them in Wa'ali Salaam many, many prophets made right, to, the, to the nations. And Fajam uh, Bayinati, they came to their nation with clear signs, miracles. But but uh, the people are unlikely to believe and they already they already rejected earlier. And we seal the hearts of those who uh, transgress and oversteps who, who, the, who, over, overstep, who overstep the limits of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Then we sent after them, uh, after the Rasul Musa alayhi salam and Harun alayhi salam with clear signs to Fir'aun and his ministers and his chief. However, they were arrogant, they refused to accept the truth. And they were from nations of those who were sinners. When the truth came to them from us, they said, this is clear magic. Musa said, do you, do you say with regard to the truth when it comes to you? Is this magic? Magicians are never successful. They, may the Fir'aun Fir and his ministers and chief, they said, have you come to us to turn us away from that from the religion which we found our forefathers following? So that the two of you, so that the two of you, may attain 
leadership or fame on earth. We shall never, we shall never believe you to what you say. See, it's about it's about the all these people, right? These people who had power at the time, even even the time of Rasulullah or even uh, the story right now, Musa alayhi salam. They knew, right? Deep down, they knew that okay, yes, Allah is there, but they just don't want to accept. They don't want to accept that okay, he's a true prophet. He's just too arrogant, right? That's it's all about arrogance. That oh, how can these lowly people be? You know, uh, how can they get the message? And how can they just too are arrogant, right? Even Abu Jahl and all these people in the time of Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, okay, they knew that okay, yeah, that it is true, but they just too, they're just too, they had so much takabur, and they were just always arrogant, right? They just couldn't accept. Uh, Fir'aun said, bring every uh, bring every learned magic, the person who has uh, who's expert at this. Then when when magician came and they challenged Musa alayhi salam, Musa alayhi salam told him, throw, I mean, throw your sticks and ropes, which so alqumantum uh, alqun, throw the sticks which you throw. Then they told Musa alayhi salam when they uh, when they threw they threw the sticks and ropes, Musa alayhi salam told them, what you have displayed is magic. In uh, Allah say, to Allah subhanahu has shown Allah subhanahu wa taala he had uh, eliminated he had destroyed its effect. In Allah that is not Allah subhanahu wa taala does not allow the action of the mischief. Allah establishes and confirms the truth with his words. Through, uh, even though if the wrong believers, if they dislike it, فما من الموسى إلا ذرية من قوم على خوف من فرعون وملائهم أن يقتلهم وإن فرعون العالي في الأرض وإنه لمن المسيبين. Only a few people from his nation believed in Musa alayhi salam, fearing that Fir'aun and his ministers would put them in, would put them to trial. So وإن فرعون العالي في الأرض. Fir'aun was in a position of superiority, high hand. He was, he had high, he had the upper hand, and in the land. We know Levin Musifin, and he was certainly from amongst those who uh, were transgressors. Well, Qala Musa Yaqumin Kutu Amunatum Billah. Musa Ali Sam said people, oh, people, if you believe in Allah SWT, then rely only on Him, where right? He will help you against your enemies. Fali Tokarin Kutu Musifin, if you are, uh, if you really are believers. Well, Qala Allah Tokarin, they said we rely only on Allah SWT, our Rabb, our Rabbana, and our Rabb, and our Rabb, and our Rabb, and make us a test for the oppressive ones. Right, this is also one of the du'as that we should recite. رَبَّنَا لَا تَجْعَلْنَا فِتْنَةً لِلْقَوْمِ الظَّالِمِينَ right, Do not make us a test for the oppressive ones. Mean, let, do not let them overpower us and think that they are on the on the right path while they're not. Right, they should, we should make this du'a also that do not make us a test for the oppressive ones and do not let them overpower us. وَنَجِّنَا بِرَحْمَتِكَ مِنَ الْقَوْمِ الْكَافِرِينَ And our Rabb rescue us with your mercy from this uh, this uh, slavery and you know this zulm and those from those who do not have iman. Oh, we saw a relation to Musa alayhi salam and his brother, uh, Harun alayhi salam, saying to them. Establish your homes, establish homes for your people in Egypt, and make your homes place of worship and establish salah, and give uh, glad tidings to the. Give glad tidings to the believers. Musa said, "Oh Rabb, indeed you have granted uh, luxuries and riches and wealth to Fir'aun and his ministers in this worldly life." This this wealth they use they led others astray from your path, right from the Tawheed. Rabbana atmis ala amwali mashtul ala qulubiyam fala imino hatta yirul ala bina. Oh Rabb, destroy their wealth so they cannot use it for evil purpose and harden their hearts so that they do not have iman until they witness a painful punishment. قَالَ قَدْ أُجِيبَ الدَّعْوَةُكُمْ فِي السَّقِيمَةِ وَلَا تَتْبِعَانِ السَّبِيلَ الَّذِينَ لَا يَعْلَمُونَ so he, meaning Allah SWT, he said that the prayer of those two have been accepted in the, uh, of Harun A.S. and Musa A.S. So uh, they remain upright and they steadfast on your call and never, and never follow the path of those without knowledge. 
وجاوزنا ببني إسرائيل البحر فأتبعهم فرعون وجنوده بغيا وعدوى حتى إذا أدرك الغرق قال ما أنه لا إله إلا الذي آمن به بنو إسرائيل وأنا من المسلمين After escaping uh, we made the Bani Israel cross the sea where the Red Sea while Fir'aun and his army they chased them uh, and they Fir'aun uh, وجنوده بغيا وعدوى but uh, tyranny and you know they thought that they, they continued to chase and they entered the the pathway that Allah subhanahu wa created for Bani Israel in the sea until Fir'aun began to drown. Fir'aun حتى إذا أدرك الغرق قال أمنتو until Fir'aun began, began to drown and when he said I believe that there is no ilah but him in whom Bani Israel believe. وأنا أكون من المسلمين and I am from those from those who surrender. Right? That time is too late. Uh, he's, he's got the punishment of Allah SWT and now he wants to believe. Al-an, uh, it was said to him, do you believe only now? Al-an, waqad asid, and now, when all you were disobedient before, min qablu wa kuntum min al-musidin, you were, wa kuntum min al-musidin, you were among those who were, who used to cause corruption. فَالْيَوْمَنُ نَجِيكَ بِبَذْنِكَ لِتَكُونُ لِمَنَ خَلْفَكَ آيَةً إِنَّ كَثِيرًا مِنَ النَّاسِ عَنْ آيَاتِنَا لَغَافِرُونَ It was told to him, today we shall save you with your body to be an ayah, a sign, a lesson for those uh, for those who come after you. And when the kathira, unfortunately, there are, there are still, there's still many people who are still negligent on ayat in Allah, but they're still negligent in, of our ayat, of our signs. And you can still, you can still go see Fir'an's body still there. Indeed, we settled the Bani Israel in, in a pleasant and a nice place and provided them with pure things. And they did not differ until knowledge came to them. Surely your Rabb decides between them on the day of judgment about that which they deferred. فإن كنت في شك مما أنزلنا إليك فاسأل الذين يقرؤون الكتاب من قبلك لا قد جاءك الحق من ربك فلا تكونن من الممترين. If you are in any doubt about what we have revealed about the truth, right, about the instance that I mentioned the Quran, then ask. فاسأل الذين يقرؤون الكتاب من ask those who are reciting the book, the Torah before you. لا قد جاءك الحق من ربك فلا تكونن من الممترين. Definitely the truth has come to you from your Rabb, so do not be from amongst those من الممترين from those who. Have doubt. Never be from those who deny Allah SWT. For then you'll be from then you'll be from amongst us khasi amongst the losers. Without doubt, those against whom the word of your Rabb has passed will not accept Iman. Even though every ayah comes to them and they see the painful punishment. Even though they, they still, uh, the, they'll still disbelieve in Allah SWT. There has been a no nation who accepted Islam just before Allah's punishment struck them. Where there's no, where, where the Iman uh, benefited them because they were saved from Allah's punishment, except, uh, except the nation of Yunus. There was no nation, there has been no nation who accepted, who accepted Iman, where the Iman benefited them, except Illa Qawm Yunus, except Yunus alayhi salam, the people of the nation of Yunus, when they accepted Iman, we turned away from them a punishment of disgrace in the worldly life, and then we, and we granted them enjoyment for a while. O Muhammad, if you're Rabb, if you're Rabb, if you're Rabb, who wanted all those, all those on earth who would surely have Iman, will you force people, if I took it in Nas, will you force the people until they become believers? No, right? So your job is just preach. No soul can have Iman without Allah SWT's order. Allah has set Allah SWT has set impurity and kufr upon those who do not understand. 
قل ينظروا ماذا قل ينظروا ماذا في السماوات قل ينظروا ماذا في السماوات ونظروا ما تغني الايات ونظروا عن قوم لا يؤمنون say look at look whatever is in the heavens and the earth or ma tughni ayat the ayat and the warnings are are of no use to the people who do not like you know who do not have iman fal yantadiru illa mis ayyam alladhina khalaw min qablihim are they mean the kuffar waiting only for the time for the punishment that comes to, that comes to those before them before accept islam say قل فانتظر اني معكم المنتصر يو وي ان اي شو بي فور مونسوس وي ثم نجي رسولنا والذين امنوا كذلك حقا علينا ننجي المؤمنين then we rescued our rasul uh, our rasul our messengers and the mu'min likewise and it is حقا علينا is our uh, their our uh, guarantee or our duty to rescue the believers from punishment يقول لي ايها الناس ان كنتم في شك من ديني فلا اعبدوا الذين تعبدون من دون الله ولكن اعبد الله الذي يتوفاكم وانتم تكون من المؤمنين say oh people if you are in doubt about my deen then i do not worship what you worship besides allah subhanahu wa ta'ala those idols and gods however ولكن اعبد ولكن اعبد الله الذي يتوفاكم however i worship that allah who will يتوفاكم who will give you death who will take your life وامرت انا وامرت ان اكون مؤمنين have been commanded to be from amongst those who are the mu'minin wa naqim wajhak lid-din hanifa and focus your attention towards the deen in such a way that you turn away from all religions and other practices and wala takun min mushrikin to be from amongst those who are mushrikin wala tad'u min dun la ma la yanfa'uk wa la yadurruk fa in fa'alta fa innaka idhan min al-dhalimin and besides allah do not call on do not worship any being who cannot uh benefit ma la yanfa'uk wa la yadurruk na benefit uh not call on those any being who cannot benefit nor harm you then falta if you do so then you will be fainna kidha min al-zalimin then you will be from amongst those who are the oppressors of wrongdoers wa in yamsaka allah bi dhurmi fala kashi wa lahu illahu if allah subhanahu wa ta'ala fixes you with any harm no one can remove it besides him and when you ridika bi khairin fala radi al fadi and if he intends good for you then no one can prevent his grace from reaching you who all uh فلا راضي يصيب بما يشاء من عباده الله سبحانه بيستاز غيس اون اون اوف هيز سيرفنتس هو ايفر هو ايفر هي بليزز اند هي از وهو الغفور الرحيم از موست فيجيفين موست مرسيفول قل يا ايها الناس قد جاءكم الحق من ربكم فمن اهتدى فانما يهتدي لنفسه وما ضل فانما يضل عليها وما انا وما انا عليكم بوكيل قل يا ايها الناس سي او بيبل سي رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم او بيبل سيرن ذا تروث هاز كم تو يو فروم يور رب So whoever will be guided, they will get guidance. They will receive guidance only from himself. Whoever will go astray will go astray only to his own. For his, to will be only will be only he will go astray, because he will have to su- suffer the consequences right of his incorrect choices. I'm not a guardian of you. Right? I'm not. I'm not someone that will be answerable for what you do. What the Bama Yuhai Lega was for Hatta Mullah, but who are the Hakimin? No, Rasulullah Sallam. Follow what has been revealed to you, and have sabr, have patience. Hatta Mullah until Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Decision will come. Right? The kufar, they'll they'll be punished for not accepting Islam. Who are the Hakimin? Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. He is the best of deciders. Alhamdulillah. We finish Surah Yunus. Uh, the next Surah, Surah Hud. Uh, in this surah, Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala in Surah Hud, Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala talks about those people who they neglect, right? About uh, the about wahi about revelation, and Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala reminds that Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala has the only Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala has the knowledge of the unseen, and only call on towards Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, and is because this is also a Makki uh, surah, so Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala is he's going to talk about you know even Nuh Alayhi Salam. Or he says that I am an Nadir Mubin. I am a clear warner and worship Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. And who the Alayhi Salam also in the incident of Ibrahim Alayhi Salam, Lut Alayhi Salam. Okay, so those stories will come up, inshallah. A'udhu Billahi Min Ash-Shaytan Wa Bismi Allahi Rahman Rahim Alif Lam Ra Kitab Ahkamat Ayat Wa Thumma Fussilat Min Ladun Hakim Min Khabir Alla Ta'budu Illa Allah Inna Lilakum Min Huna Dhiru Wa Bashir Wa Nistaghfiru Rabbakum Thumma Tubu Ilayu Mati'akum Mata'an Hasanan Ila Ajalim Musamma Wa Yutibu Alladhi Fadlin Fadla Wa In Tawallu Fa'inni Khafu Alaykum Adhaab Yawm Kabir Alif Lam Ra Right. Only Allah Subhanahu wa Taala knows the correct meaning of these letters. The Quran, the Kitab, the Ayatul, the verses which have been 
uh, which has been are uh, the completely excellently structured and they're the comprehensive and they're eloquent. And then they have been explained. It has been explained the clear meaning to the people from it has been and it's from the from the one the, the one who is wise, Allah SWT and Khabir, the one who is informed. Allah SWT, He is all aware, He is known of everything. Allah Ta'abdu illa Allah. Worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Indeed, I, meaning Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa the one who warns you, and I am the one who gives good, glad tidings for the believers. You should seek forgiveness from your Rabb and then turn to Him. Obey, obey Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's commandments, and He will grant you enjoyment matan hasana and a comfortable life. Uh, until he, until the time we die, and then Allah Subhanahu wa Taala will take all the Allah Subhanahu wa Taala will also grant His uh, grace and His fadl favors and rewards to every graceful person. Whoever, wait, right? But if you turn away from Islam, then I then inni akhaf alikum. Then I fear the the punishment for the adab yaman kabir of the serious day. In Allah marjirakum to Allah Subhanahu wa Taala, you shall return me in death. Wa ala kulli shi'in qali Allah Subhanahu has power over everything. Ala inna mithluna sudur amni astaghfu min. Behold, verily, they are, I mean, that some people, they turn the chest so that they may hide from him. Behold, Behold, that when they were, they close, thinking that they hide themselves from Allah SWT, he knows what they hide as well, as what they disclose. Allah SWT knows the secrets of their hearts. The responsibility of sustaining every creature on earth is with Allah SWT. It's upon Allah SWT. Allah SWT knows where they will stay and uh, and the place where they will be kept in trust. Everything is in the clear book. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he, he is the one who created the skies and the earth in six days when his throne was, uh, his throne is on the, upon the water. Uh, to test which of you carries out better actions. Surely if you say that indeed you will be resurrected, brought back to life after that, then those who commit kufr will definitely reply that in in hadha illa sihr mubin that this Quran which speaks about the resurrection is clear magic. Indeed, if we have we have, if we postpone if you postpone the punishment from them for a little while, they will certainly say mockingly, "Oh, what holds it back?" Behold, that the day when it will afflict them, it will not be turned away from them. The punishment will not be turned away from them and their mockery will surround them. And definitely we will allow uh, the, the, the insan, the human being to taste our mercy and then snatch it away from him. He will certainly be despondent and disappointed and be un ungrateful. And the contrary, if we allow him to taste any bounty of hardships and afflicted him, he will certainly say, all difficulties have left me. Right? And then he then he becomes boastful and arrogant instead of being grateful. Except those who exercise sabr patience and those who do good deeds, for them there will be forgiveness and great reward. Uh, that you ignore some of the commands that have been revealed to you, nor that your heart grieves because they, mean the Mashikin, they say, uh, Why is the treasure not sent down to him? Or why does not angel accompany him? You are but the one who warns, right? you are the one who just warns. The people in the Allah has control over all things. Yeah, there's no need to be the the mushrikin or mock, but it is not your duty, right, to force the people to accept iman. They, they, so they shouldn't grieve, and uh, they they would 
uh, you just leave them. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he has control over all things. Am yaqulu naftara wal fa'tu bi'ashri suwari mithli muftariyati wad'u mani sata'atum min dunillahi in kutum sadiqeen. Or the kufar, they say that he, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, has fabricated the Qur'an. Qul fa'tu, then say, bring forth 10 uh, fabricated surahs like it. Right? Let's see if we can make something. Wad'u mani sata'atum and call all the help. Call whoever you can in Qutum Sadiqin. If you are, call whoever you want besides Allah SWT if you are truthful. فَإِنْ لَمْ يَسْرِيبُ لَكُمْ فَعْلَمُ أَنَّمَا أُنْزِرِ بِعِلْمِ اللَّهِ وَأَدْ لَا إِلَهِ اللَّهُ فَالْأَنْتُمْ مُسْلِمُونَ If they do not respond to you, then know that this Qur'an has been revealed, if, has been revealed by Allah SWT's knowledge. And وَأَدْ لَا إِلَهِ اللَّهُ There's no deity by Allah SWT فَالْأَنْتُمْ مُسْلِمُونَ So will you not be from amongst those who are Muslim? And can you do the hayat to the nawazina tanwafi ilayhim? Whoever desires the life, the life of this world and its luxuries, we shall grant them the full reward for their good deeds in this very world, and they will not be from uh, they will not be wrong. They are the ones who shall have only nothing but the fire for themselves in the akhirah. Whatever, whatever action they did in the world will be lost to them, and their good deeds will be in vain. Because they will, they will see no reward for these in the Akhirah. Or well, they will require them the most because that time they were only, uh, that time they only had a worldly, uh, they, only, they, only, they only wanted the world. Can the one who is steadfast in the clear proof of the Quran from his Rabb and the one uh, can the one who is on the clear proof from his from his Rabb, which is followed by a witness from him, meaning from Jibreel alayhi salam, who bought the Quran from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and before it by the book, and before the book by the Musa alayhi salam, which is Torah, which was guide, and he, it was a mercy, Imam al Rahma, and he was, he, was a, uh, he was a guide which led the people, and it was a mercy to the people. And the Torah mentioned the coming of Rasulullah in the Quran. These people, they believed in it. And whoever rejects it from the group, meaning of the kufar, then the fire will be the abode. So do not be in doubt about it. It is indeed the truth from your Rabb, and most people do not know. Who can be more just than who person who creates lie, events lie against Allah SWT. Those people will be presented before the Rabb, and they'll be, uh, they'll be, and the witnesses will say that these are the ones who. These are the ones who attribute lies to the Rabb. So behold, the curse of Allah SWT is on them, on the liars. Uh, those who prevented others from Allah's mother path and uh, they they saw crookedness in it in Islam rejected the Akhirah. Such people are not likely to escape on earth, and besides besides Allah they shall. They will not have any helpers. And their punishment will be doubled. And they have neither the ability, they will not have the ability to hear the truth, nor they can, they won't be able to see. They are the ones who have ruined themselves, and whatever they, whatever they the fabricated, will be lost to them. Without doubt, they'll be the worst of the losers in the Akhirah. إِنَّ الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا وَعَمِنُوا الصَّالِحَاتِ وَأَخْبَتُوا إِلَىٰ رَبِّهِمْ وَلَيْكَ أَصْحَابُ الْجَنَّةِ Surely those who have Iman, who do righteous action, and who humble themselves before their Rabb, they are the resident. وَلَيْكَ أَصْحَابُ الْجَنَّةِ They are the people of Jannah, where they shall live forever. فِي الْخَالِدِ مَثَلِ الْفَرِيقِينِ كَالْعَمَى وَالْأَصْلَمِ وَالْبَصِيرِ وَالْسَمِيعِ The example of the two groups is like the, of the person who is blind and deaf, where they compare to the people, these two people who can see and hear. Can, the, can both of them, uh, can both them be equal? Will you not take heed? Uh, 
Indeed, we sent Wahi Salam to his nation, and he and he said, "I'm a Nadir will be clean, clear one. Allah Taala will Allah worship Allah Subhanahu wa Taala. Inni al-Khaf alik ma'adam if if you do the punishment of the day. Baqal ma'ala Allah Taala kubra min qawmi ma'ana raka illa bashar mithra ma'ana raka tabaq illa Allah Taala maradi min qati ra'i. The disbeliever, the disbelieving leaders, the chief of his nation said, "We consider you to be just a, a normal human like us, and we only see the people, those people who follow you are just low class, and and they are bad ra'i. They are simple-minded people." And we see a man, a man of the and we don't see any, you know, we see no superiority in you over us. So, but in fact, we think you to be all liars, so that therefore they will not follow you. Like the many, many nations, right? the people who are Islam fail to realize that a Nabi has to be a human being. Angels are unable to be effective as Ambiya. Right, they do not have the same needs as human beings, and they're they're if they um, if the angels came, they'll be like, oh, oh, they're not like us, so we can't follow them. You know, we they are not like us, so there's some they're just a different creation. people tell me if I am if I am on a a clear proof, proof from from my Rabb, and He has granted me a mercy from Himself. Then that is unclear to you. Then uh, can we force it on you? When you want uh, to when you dislike it, when you disapprove of it, well, my people, I do not ask you for any wealth. In my word, my word is with my Rabb, and I cannot drive away those who have iman. Made noise. Some said this when the people they expressed that they would follow him only if he uh, disassociated himself with his followers who were poor people. Surely they will meet the Rabb. And however, I see you to be amongst the foolish people. My people who will assist, who will assist me, who will help me against Allah SWT. If I disregard the mu'mineen, will you not take heed? If I do not, um, I do not state to you that I possess the treasures of Allah SWT. Nor do I have the knowledge and say, Wala inni malik. And nor do I, do I say that I'm an angel. Wala, wala and I cannot say concerning those who you look down upon that Allah SWT will never grant them good. Allah, Allah knows what is in your in their hearts. Indeed, uh, in, I will be from amongst the wrongdoers. He said, oh, only Allah SWT will bring it punishment if he wills, and you will not be able to escape. My advice to you will not benefit you if I intend to guide you while in kind of you don't you welcome if Allah SWT intends you to send you astray. He is your Lord, he is your Rabb, and you will return to him. Or do they, the Kufar Makkah, say that Rasulullah has fabricated the Quran? Qul in if they had, if they had fabricated, if they had, uh, if they have, if the Rasulullah has fabricated it, then Fadi uh, Ajrami, then the crime is on me, meaning you are absolutely free from this, right? And I am free from the crime that you carry out, meaning saying that the meaning of rejecting Allah's word and saying that is mine, where I am free. From what you say, it was revealed to Nabi Salah that none of your people shall ever have Iman, but those who already have Iman. So do not be grieved of what they do. May the Shirk was not full of Yahina build an ark before us, uh, and by our revelation, by our command, do not address, uh, do not, do not tell those. Um, the oppressors in Mughraqoon they should certainly be John. So Allah commanded him, so he in no Islam he continued to build the ark. Whenever the leaders of his people passed by him, they mocked him, right? Because they're like, What is this? You know, you're building an ark, what are you doing? You know, they started mocking him, they started insulting him. They told him that they were that he was foolish to build an ark when there was no water, right? There was no water there. So then, that uh, they mocked him. And when said, if you mock us, then we shall also 
we will also have the opportunity to mock you just as you do right the time will come watch on your john but so that on soon you shall come to know when who will be afflicted by a humiliating degrading punishment and to whom there shall be a way hello ali adam muqim there shall be a eternal punishment that will come hatta idha jaa ma nawafara tar nur qul nahmil fiha min kulli zawjin ithnayni wa hadak illa ma sabaqa alayhi qawlu man aman wa ma amana ma'ahu illa qalil until the time when our command has came Right? and the water began to gush from the fountain from the earth and we said to Nuh alayhi salam load now load on to the ark right and a pair of, of, from every species and your family except those whom the decision has been passed meaning his wife and one of his son right uh, they couldn't be on the ark because they were also from amongst the disbelievers and whoever has iman right they should also go on the ark they should go on wama amana ma'ahu illa qalil with them there were only few people who had iman وقال القبو فيها بسم الله مجريها ومرسها ان ربي الغفور الرحيم ان عيسى امسر ان بارك عن وتنيب الله سبحانه وتعالى ان شر ترافل ان انكر ومرسها ما رب ان ربي الغفور الرحيم ان ربي از موست فيجي من موست موست فيجي وهي تجيب في موجين كالجبال ونادى نوح ابن هو كان في معزني يا بني كم معنا ولا تكون من الكافرين and it traveled uh, with them the waves that were like the mountains right it was the waves were like the size of the mountains why some call unto his son his scoffer son who was who stood apart from them outside the ark saying oh my son come board with us but at the command do not be do not be from amongst the kuffar he said qal sa awila jabni yasimuni min ma hu par i shall uh, take refuge in a shelter on a mountain that will rescue me from the water no ali salam said qal al asim al yawm today no one will be rescued no one will be rescued right from the command from the person of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala min amri Allah illa man rahim except whom Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has special mercy wa hala bainahum al mawjud fa kana bil muqrafin then a wave separated the two the wave separated no ali sana san and he became from those who min al muqrafin from those who drown imagine a father seeing his own son drowning wa qila ya ard bil'ain ma aki wa ya sama wa qila wa ghayz al ma wa qud al amr wa astawat al juwdi wa qila bu'd lil qawm al zalimin the order was issued from allah subhanahu wa ta'ala on earth ya ardul aima aki wa ya sama o earth swallow your water and sky stop raining the water subsided and the decision the to destroy the people of nuhay sanam was over and the ark settled on wa qila wa sawd al judi on on mount judi wa qila bu'd lil qawm al zalimin it was announced may the oppressive nation be distant and be far from the from allah's mercy ونادى نوح ربه فقال ربي ان ابني من اهلي وان وعدك الحق وانا تحكم الحاكمين نوحي سلام قال تو رب سينج اسكي با ود هي نوز او ماي رب شيرلي ماي سون هو از جون از فروم ماي فاميلي اند انديد يور بروميس تو ريسكيو ماي فاميلي فروم فروم ذا فلود از ترو مي واي واز هي نا بليس وذ ايمان نا سيف نو فلود بت وان تحكم الحاكمين يو ار فروم امونغست ذا بيست جادجز سو ذير فور يو نو ذا جود ريزن واي يو الاو هيم تو جو قال يا نوح انه ليس من اهلك الله سبحانه وتعالى سز نو الله سبحانه وتعالى نوح عليه السلام انه الان ليس من اهلك is not he was not from your family he was destined to be he was not destined to be a mu'min like the others so therefore he cannot be saved انه عمل غير صالح his action was certainly incorrect he committed kufr and he rejected iman so فلا تسالني ما ليس لك به do not ask me about that which you have no knowledge about اني اعذك ان تكون مجاهدا i advise you not to be from the ignorant قال ربي اني اعوذ بك ان اسالك ما ليس لي به علم فابيس ان علي سلام his son his son is part of him part of his family so he, he was obviously felt hurt so that's why he asked Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala but then you know he realized that you know I should have asked this so قال ربي اني اعوذ بك ان اسالك ما ليس لي به علم الا ما ليس لك به علم ذا او ماي رب نو اي سنسر ما اي سيك بروتكشن فروم اسكينج يو اباوت ذيس ثينج ويتش اي هاف نو نوليدج اباوت والا تغفر لي وترحمني اكون من الخاسرين That if you do not, uh, if you do not forgive me and I don't have mercy on me, then I'll be from amongst those who are the losers. Qili ya nuh bi tabi salami minna barakatun alaihi wa maala wa maamim min maqo wa maamu sanu ma tiyum thumai musub minna adabun alim. He was commanded, O Nuh alaihi salam, eh bi tabi salam, come down from the ark with peace from us and blessings upon you, upon those people with you. And there shall be many uh, groups of the kafir to whom you will. grant do we many of the the and there shall come some um some um um some um matiahum thumma musu min adab alim and there should be from many of the the groups that to whom we you we will grant enjoyment into this world and then subject them 
and that we would afflict with them a painful punishment. Tilka min anba al-ghayb in wahi highlight this story. My son is from the knowledge of the unseen that we, we inspire you with Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. You and your people were unlikely to have knowledge about this before. Before the Quran. So, فصبر in al-aqibat al-muttaqeen. Be steadfast and in al-aqibat al-muttaqeen. Indeed, the final outcome will be those who have taqwa. وَإِلَعَادِ الْأَخَامْ هُدَى No, Allah SWT talks about Aad to the nation of Aad. We sent their brother Hud alayhi salam qariya qum Allah. He said, oh my people, worship Allah SWT. There is no deity beside him. In antum illa muftaroon. You people are only lying. يَا قُلْ مِنَا سَلُكُمْ عَلِهِ أَجْرَوْا My people are not ask you for any reward for this. My reward is إِنَّجِي لَعَلَى الَّذِي فَطَرَنِي My reward is responsibility of that being, of that, of that of being me, that Allah SWT who has created me. أَفَلَا تَعْقِنُ Do you not understand? My people seek forgiveness from your Rabb and then turn to him. Then he will send abundant rain and it would give you strength. And do not turn away. Do not turn away from the do not turn away as wrongdoers. They replied, Oh, oh, oh Islam, you have not brought forth a proof, a miracle that you are a Nabi. So we will not leave our gods just by your word. And we shall not be, we shall not believe in you. We shall not believe in you without proof. All we have to say is that one of our gods has afflicted you with evil. Meaning he has made you insane. He said, I call to Allah. I call to Allah as witness and you and also you to witness that I am free from the partners that you have. Apart from Allah, so all of you, they may plot against me and do not grant me any respite. I rely on Allah SWT, only Allah SWT. And who is who is uh, who is uh, he has full control of the four locks of every creature. He has complete he has complete control over them. Uh, indeed, my Rabb is. So if you turn away then, know that I have certainly conveyed to you that which I have been sent to you from my Rabb. And Allah he can substitute you with another nation. And you will not be able to harm him at all. Indeed Allah's mother is aware of all things. When, when our punishment came, we saved Huda Isa, I mean, those people who were with him by mercy and we rescued him from a severe punishment. This was Ad. They rejected the ayat of the Rabb and disobeyed his Rasul, they disobeying the Messenger and followed it. They followed, they followed every uh, the tyrant. Curse and was made to follow on them in this world and in the Akhirah as well. Behold, Aad disbelievers, wait, the Aad, they disbelieve in their Rabb. Behold, may the Aad and the people of Hud be distant from Allah's mercy. Allah now is talking about uh, nation Thamud, we sent and uh, to the nation of Thamud, we sent their brother Salih as a Nabi. He said, Qari Yaqub Abdullah Malik bin Ali. He said, Oh, my people, show Allah, there is no deity besides him. He created in Huan Shaq, and Radi was Tamar Kumfiya, Fasafiru Tamatu Bile, and created from earth, and he has settled you on it. So, Fasafiru Tamatu Bile, Narabi Qari Bu Mujib, so seek forgiveness from him and turn to him. And Allah SWT, he is near and he will respond. They said, Oh, sorry, certainly we, we have, uh, we had high hopes in you before, you know, before you started preaching Tawheed to us. But now, um, do you forbid us from worshipping that our forefathers worship? We are in such we are in such doubt about you. I mean, you call us towards that which has which has that, has, that which has put you into doubt yourself. He said, "Oh my people, tell me that if I if uh, if I, I am on a clear proof, 
كنت على بينة أفهم أنه clear proof from الرب وأتاني منه رحمة and he has granted me a mercy from himself فمن ينصرني من الله who can assist me against the, the punishment of Allah سبحانه وتعالى in عصيط if I disobey him فما تزيني غير تقصير you only increase me in loss يا قومي هذه ناقة الله لكم آية فذروها تأكل في أرضي الأولاد مصوها and then uh, he said oh, yeah, uh, oh my people this this uh, this camel which came from obviously the mountain is Allah's camel right which Allah he sent as a Allah's camel which is an ayah which is a sign a miracle for you to prove you that I am Allah's Nabi so leave it to graze in Allah's land and do not touch it so do not touch it if you do then the punishment will afflict you however they killed it they, they hamstrung it and the pregnant she came with it died where they killed it so for Allah says to which uh, he والسلام, said enjoy yourselves in your homes for three days after which Allah SWT, Allah's punishment will destroy you but, uh, this is a promise that will not uh, that will not prove the false when our punishment came we saved والسلام, and those who were with him who had iman by our mercy from the humiliation of that day and indeed your Rabb is powerful and mighty a terrible scream from the sky killed the oppressors and they were left laying face down in their homes. As if they had never existed there. Behold, they disbelieve in the Rabb. And may Thamud be distant from Allah's mercy. And now Allah is talking to Ibrahim. Indeed, our messengers, angels came to Ibrahim with good news that he will be a father of a son and he will also have grandsons after, afterwards. And they greeted him. What salam he said, salam uh, and he and did not hesitate to bring a roasted calf, right, to entertain them because they were guests. But but obviously uh, there were angels who did not eat the meal, right? They didn't eat the gap, calf. So فلما رأيهم لا تصير نكرا موجسا مخيفا قالوا لا تخف. So then when he noticed that their hands were not touching towards him, they weren't eating. He grew fearful, thinking that they had come to harm him. So they said, "Let us No, do not fear. We have been sent to destroy the in our sin. We have been uh, destroyed. We have been sent to destroy the uh, nation of Lut alayhi salam. Umratu qaimatu fadhahikat fabashna bi ishaqla. His wife standing and laughed with happiness as we conveyed to her the good news. As she should be given, she should be giving birth to the son by the name of Ishaq alayhi salam. And then. Uh, and then after they have grandson name Yaqub also. Uh, after uh, after Ishaq they have a grandson named Yaqub. Did she said in astonishment? Oh, like really? You know, will I will I bear a child when I'm an old woman? Meaning she was over eighty years old. And my husband, he's an old man. He's over hundred years old. In this is indeed a strange uh, matter. They mean the angels said, Are you surprised? Meaning, are you wondering at the command and the power of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala who can do anything? May Allah mercy, may Allah's mercy and blessing be on you. Oh, Ahl Bayt, the, the members of the household, may Ibrahim alayhi salam. Allah subhanahu is worthy of all praise and he is exalted, he's lofty, he's high. When the fear left Ibrahim السلام, and the good news reached him, he pleaded with us regarding the nation of Nuh and debated that the angels should not destroy a city when there's mu'mineen in it. So in Ibrahim al-Harim indeed Ibrahim alayhi salam was forbearing, he was tolerant, he was compassionate and he repented to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Ibrahim However, the debate grew too long and the angels said, oh, Ibrahim, refrain, refrain this. Refrain from this, turn away, stop debating regarding this matter. Allah SWT sent us, that's it. Without doubt, the command of your Rabb has come and it will take place. Soon there should be a punishment that will come to them and they cannot turn away. Uh, uh, when our messengers came to Lut and he became distressed because of their presence and his heart tightened 
right? Because the angels appeared as handsome young men. And Lut feared that his people would want to commit would want to commit some, you know, evil action with them, with the with the angels. He said, this is a day of misfortune. As he feared, his people came running to him to see his guest, right? And this was nothing new before, right? So his people came running to him. And before this, they had always engaged in evil deeds. So Lut said, oh, my people, you know, because obviously he didn't want to make himself embarrassed in front of the angels that Allah SWT sent. So he said, how would I banati? These are my daughters, right? The me, the women of the tribe. They are more uh, they are more pure for you. So marry them and satisfy yourself with and fear Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And do not disgrace me. Please do not disgrace me in front of my guests. Is there not any uh, righteous man amongst you? Any single righteous man amongst you? They replied, you know very well that we have no interest in your daughters. Right, and you are also well aware of our intentions. He said, if only I had some strength against you, or if only I could seek protection from a strong pillar or a powerful tribe. So he, the angel said, oh, we are just messengers of your Rabb. They will never be able to reach or harm you. So leave the city with your family uh, during the night of the, during a portion of the night. And uh, no one should turn and look back except your wife. Do not take her with you because she will be afflicted with the same punishment that shall afflict them because she was also, um, she was also part of that. Uh, she would also do that type of sin. Uh, the morning has been fixed for the punishment. Is the morning not soon enough? When our punishment came, we made the upper portion of the land and the lower portion. The lower portion means the cities, the city were lifted and they were thrown upside down. And and we rained down on the land continuously with stones on them. And that were marked by your Rabb, meaning every stone had the name of the person it was meant to strike. And these, stored, these cities were destroyed. And they are not far from the oppressors. Uh, inshallah, we'll just end here for today. <sighs> Alhamdulillah, we finished the first half of the 12th juz. Um, what page? Uh, ayah number 83. We'll continue from Wayda Madina Kham Shaiba from Ayah uh, 84, inshallah. So. Would you please do the tafsir for Ayah 46, 46 of Um Qari Anu Inna Wa Laysa Min Ahlik Inna Wa Amilun Ghayru Salih Wa La Tasanli Ma Laysa Lak Bi Ilm Ayah number 46 Qari Anu Inna Wa Laysa Min Ahlik Inna Wa Amilun Ghayru Salih Wa La Tasanli Ma Laysa Lak Bi Ilm Inni A'idhu Ka An Takuna Min Jahirin Allah said Oh Nuh Right? Because Nuh A.S. He said that Oh look He was from my Um he made dua to his Rabb and he said, Look, that my son was from amongst my family, and your truth, your truth was your, your, your promise is true, right? Meaning that you said you will save my family, you save my family from the punishment. So Allah said, So Allah says, He's not from here, um, He's not from amongst the, He's not from your people, He did not do any righteous deed. So do not ask about what you do not know. Indeed, I advise you to not be from amongst those who are ignorant. What did Nabi Salam said to people on Ayah 71?
IS-71. His wife, um, so his wife, me, Sara she was standing and she, she laughed with happiness. As we conveyed to her and we told her the good news that she'll be giving birth to a son by the name of Ishaq. And after Ishaq, there will be Yaqub. I mean, Yaqub will be the grand, grand uh, child after Ishaq. Um, what's the next surah? We have to love your now. Surah Hud, Surah Toba, Surah Hud 41. Um, I'll call her Kabufiha, Bismillah, Majereha, Musaha, in Arabi, Rafur Rahim. When Musa is salam, I mean, sorry, now, Nuh is salam. وقال ان عليه السلام said اركبوا فيها ride on in it ride in, in the I mean, go and uh, embark on it embark on the ship بسم الله مجريها with the name of Allah سبحانه وتعالى موساها and Allah سبحانه he shall travel he should make the the our travel and ومرساني who anchor it you anchor the ship in ربي الغفور الرحيم Allah is most forgiving and most merciful Two questions from Surah oh, 46. The two questions are from Surah Toba. Which which two questions? Which two questions? Um, okay. Um, is it all right to remain silent at school when it comes to gender identification? For example, my non-Muslim friend at school prefers not to be called by specific gender. Uh, what do you mean, is it all right to remain silent at school? I mean, if they're asking your opinion about it, if, a, if, a, if a, for example, my non-Muslim friend at school prefers it, so, I mean, first of all, you shouldn't have those type of friends, um, right? Those people who don't even want to... Allah SWT made everyone, right? Either you're a man or a woman, right? There's nothing... You're not, you can't change yourself to a woman or a woman can't change yourself to a man. So you should avoid uh, staying with such people because environment, right? It will, it will uh, affect the person. Uh, the type of friends you are, like, if you want to see, Rasulullah SAW said that, uh, if you want to see how a person is, look at his friend. Wait, just just by your friends, you can see what type of person you are. So you should stay away from these type of people. And there's no need to, you know, address or just mention or whatever call um, him or her or it, whatever you can call this. Just, just, I don't know, just if you want to address that person, address that person by the name. If that person dislikes, um, you know, being called by, uh, by a gender or, you know, um, so you can just mention um you can just say that okay just say the name you can just call address the person by the name you don't have to say if it's a he or she because if they don't want to be specified as a he or she i don't know you can just maybe call it a it or something i don't know but just if you say a name just say to say that or just call them address them by a name and it's better to not have those type those type of friends inshallah Okay, so we'll end here for, uh, please ask you two more ayahs from Surah Toba tomorrow. Yes, okay, inshallah. You can just let me know the ayah number. Shall okay, we end here for today? May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Uh, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us from amongst the believers and the, those mu'mineen. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us, uh, may Allah make us from amongst those who are the believers and give us Jannah. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala save us from the kuffar and from the, the the, the company of the kuffar and from them from amongst those people may Allah SWT make, make us amongst the believers and the righteous people may Allah SWT make it easy for us to uh, do more ibadah in this month especially in the month of Ramadan right or fasting may Allah SWT accept our fast may Allah SWT accept our ibadah our worship our amal whatever we do inshallah
ربنا ظلمنا أنفسنا وإن لم تغفر لنا وترحمنا لنكوننا خاسرين اللهم إنك عفو كريم تحب العفو فاعف عنا يا كريم اللهم اغفر للمؤمنين والمؤمنات والمسلمين والمسلمات الأحياء من الممات إنك سميع قريب مجيب الدعوات رب اغفر ورحم وأنت خير الرحمين ربنا لا تجعلنا في الدنيا للقوم الظالمين ونجنا برحمتك من القوم الكافرين اللهم إنا نسألك رضاك وجنتك ونعوذ بك من سخطك والنار سبحان ربك رب العزة عما يصفون وسلام على المسلمين والحمد لله رب العالمين السلام عليكم